Charles Hanley now, storming for the corner, can he go all the way, Johnson's following him, Hanley still going, and he's in, is he? Hanley in the corner for the first try, a fine try for Mallory Hanley. His strength and power took him over. And the first point to try for Ellery Hanley. <laughs> and Wigan put the first points on the board with 25 minutes gone. A try. Superb try, really, from Hanley's strength and power just took him to the line. <laughs> so, conversion attempt from Iro. He strikes it well, and it just goes wide. So, Warrington nil, Wigan four. Short one. Kevin Tamati and Boy in the tackle there on the Wigan 25. 13 minutes left in this first half. It's out to Brian Case. Case storming forward again. Finally stopped by John Woods. Dermot to Edwards. Little chip through. A trip. Hanley will kick this one on. It's a chase for the ball. Drummond, safety first from Drummond, just kicks the ball out for a scrum down. And once again, these peculiar scrums, just four men from each side making up the scrums. So, we a lot of these scrums with just four men in them. Don't think there's going to be much room for loose arms there. You can't really feed it as the ball goes in. Hits uh, Gregory's uh, heels. Little nice jink. It's on to Woods. Woods going across field still. John Woods. Edwards comes across well to bring him down. Ronnie Dwayne to McGinty. Woods again to Drummond. Knocks off one man, knocks off another still, Drummond onto Boyd, swings it back to Tamati, Tamati moves back in field, back to Boyd, Boyd, still Les Boyd, driving forward, still Boyd, lots of support, finds it from Drummond, Drummond straightens up, beats one man, still Drummond, back to Tamati, Tamati drives, beats one man, still going strong, he's stopped by Jed Byrne, what a fine sweeping move there for Warrington, inside the Wigan 25, it's Crompton, Woods, across to Dwayne, Dwayne, Dwayne straightens up himself, A couple of tackles left, John Woods to Crompton, Crompton a good sidestep himself, Cuts, beats two men, still Martin Crompton, can he get over, he's stopped five yards short, six tackle there for Warrington, Woods, Jackson kicks it through, the down ball dived on right on the winning line. And a fine tackle from Dave Lyon. Hampson lying in well again. Two on the trot for Dave Lyon. Ten minutes left in this half. Lucas. Good tackle from Boyd and Tamati. Who goes round the crowd? Hanley swings it out to Graham West. Six tackle then for Wigan. Goes out with Edwards. Edwards kicks downfield. Brian Johnson goes to cover it. Takes it safely, Brian Johnson then gets away to Dave Lyon, Lyon does well, beats one man, sensibly comes back inside, Dave Lyon still going, fine run. 
Warrington looking for a reply to that Hanley try. Woods brings in Rapati, flying forward. Rapati still going fine. Storming run from Rapati, plays it quickly. It's out with Boyd. Boyd. Beats his man beautifully, Boyd now, we've got support from McGinty, McGinty just caught, he'll get over it, he does! Billy McGinty scores! A brilliant break for Les Boyd, and it's McGinty who finishes it off. What a beautiful break for Les Boyd that was. He just beat a couple of men. And McGinty went over. And makes it 4-4. A beautiful break from Boyd. Support from Billy McGinty, whose momentum took him over John Woods. It's safely through from John Woods. Waiting in front at 6-4. So I roll to restart. 11 aside. So I roll to restart. Fires one deep. Johnson takes it superbly. Johnson gets to his feet and moves forward. Stopped by Iro. Rapati flying forward again. Certainly back to his best at the moment, Big Joe. John Woods, Woods kicks downfield. Hampson takes it safely. Thinks about a kick, comes on this near side, and a fine tackle from Ronnie Dwayne, forcing Hampson to drop the ball. Once again, these peculiar four-man scrums packed down once more. Crompton dives on it ahead of Gregory, referee's not happy. Ball in again, Crompton has it. Woods, Johnson. Looking to get away from Hampson, but can't. One was if we're going to get plenty of scoring. Now we're just 11 on each side. John Woods still was jinking about. Lost a gap and finds it. John Woods flies through the gap now. Still Woods cuts back inside. Fine. Great there from John Woods. Just spotted the gap and beat Hanley on the inside. Plays it himself. Moves forward once more. Makes it just short of the Wigan 25 before he's stopped by Brian Case. Tamati swings out right with Jackson. Jackson inside, beats his man nicely. Jackson stalls forward. Has the put from Tamati, just went down a little bit too early. Tamati swings it out with Woods. Boyd, Boyd stalls forward again, swings it back to Tamati. Tamati across to Crompton. Lovely little sidestep from Crompton. Still going, gets the ball away to Jackson. Back to Boyd. Boyd now stalls forward. Finally stopped by Hampson. Six tackle right in front of the Wigan post. Tamati chips it through for the corner. But we'll just go dead. And Wigan will restart with a tap from the 25. With seven minutes left in this first half, Wellington leading by six points to four. Edwards taps it, Gregory taps it to Brian Case. Lucas, lovely pass to West, to Gregory, Gregory stops, jinks back inside, still Gregory finally caught by Woods, looking to release Iro. Gregory talks to the referee as Iro takes it, Kevin Iro looking to go through himself, good tackle from Crompton and McGinty, out with Edwards, took it well, Edwards jinking about, gives a dummy still, Sean Edwards looking to go through the gap, Bob Jackson was there, Gregory, looking to go through himself, the ball yanked from his hands by Martin Crompton and Warrington back in possession, fine play from Crompton, not being overrun at all by Gregory at the moment, well taken by McGinty, calms things down, Bob Jackson receiving treatment, now goes back into the action, Warrington have the added bonus of having two forwards on the bench, Here's Boyd, beautiful pass to Rapati. He's got Johnson on his right hand side. Rapati to Johnson, he's powering to the line. Will he make it? What a try! What a fantastic try! Johnson finishing a 
has the prayer move. What a pass from Boyd. He ripped Wigan apart with a beautiful pass to a party. He flew through an inch perfect pass to Johnson. He had no trouble. He went in under the post for a fantastic try. What a try that was. Once again, it was Boyd, the man who made it. And it was a fine moment there for a party. Absolutely ish perfect to Brian Johnson. Yeah. And Woods, no problem for John Woods. Warrington 12, Wigan 4 with four minutes left in the half. And Bob Jackson will have to leave the field. He's playing absolute blind in this first half. Bob Jackson. And getting a good round of applause. He'll be replaced by, looks like Gary Sanderson stripping off. Oh, it could be Mark Roberts. It's Mark Roberts who comes into the action. As Gregory restarts, puts one deep. Juggles it, but takes it well. Does Johnson up to beat men on the outside. Closing stage of this first half. First touch for Roberts. Crashes in. Goes back to Dave Lyon. Lyon kicks downfield. Hampson goes back for it. Drops it. And immediately hands it on to Jed Byrne. Looking to beat on the outside, but Byrne has it well covered with Dwayne. Hanley. Once again, another crunching tackle from uh, Des Drummond. West. Dermot to Gregory. Edwards. Short pass to Lucas. Moynton tackling well at the moment. A lot of ground has to be covered with just 11 side players on each side. Gregory, oh, beautiful tackle by Millie McGinty. Sixth tackle, Edwards swings it back to West. And he'll just go down. That will be the six tackles and the turnover. Silly play from Wigan, gives Warrington possession. Salmonty to Boyd. Boyd swings it out with John Woods. Woods calms things down to let the troop tree gather. With just two minutes left in the half. Tamati to Roberts. Quite distinguishable now, Mark Roberts with the only white jersey on the field. Everybody else is covered in mud as John Woods swings it on. Well taken, Ronnie Dwayne. Dwayne, just Johnson had it coming on the link. Just didn't find him. Woods to Drummond. Drummond moves into space, flies through the centre, runs in hard. Drummond looking to get up quickly, plays it quickly to Boy. Swings it out to Tamati. Tamati now. Swings it back, it's not the best pass, but McGinty dives on it bravely. Six tackle then for Warrington. Crompton, little kick, fine kick for Martin Crompton. In the final minute of this first half, Warrington no doubt will be happy to go in with this eight point lead. And what has been absolutely incident packed half. And certainly the pre-match billing has lived up to all expectations. Gregory puts the ball in. Goes into the scrum, but Wigan in possession. Looking for a try right on half-time with Edwards to Hampson. Hampson now looking to go through the gap himself. John Woods come across well. Iro. Got strength, this lad, and Iro moves forward. His pass goes loose, Boyd picks it up, and Boyd moves into space. Once again, it's Boyd powering forward. Ripping holes in this Wigan defence, Les Boyd, as Tamati gives a dummy, finds the gap, Tamati goes through it. Can Warrington get one last score at the end of this half? We're moving into injury time. Ronnie Dwayne out towards Roberts. Knocks off Gregory, cuts back inside, gets his pass away. McGinty, McGinty still going, Gregory's on him. 
Warrington, can they get one score here right on the half time? Brian Johnson plays it back to Woods, tries to drop goal, and it's straight through from John Woods, right on half time, sensible play from Woods, and there goes the half time Hooter. Warrington going at the interval to an amazing round of applause as they go in, leading by 13 points to four. Two superb tries to Billy McGinty and Brian Johnson, two goals and a drop goal for Woods. Wigan in reply, a try from Elliot Halley, but no doubt the talking point, the two sends it off on both sides, Humphreys and Cullen for Warrington. Good way also off a shell for Duffer Wigan. Boyd had a spell in the sim bin, so a half time here at Willerspool. It's Warrington 13, Wigan 4. So the teams return for the second half. Warrington leading 13 4. A few new jerseys on the Warrington side. No changes to the 11 that finished the. First, that will start the second, look, just looking through the Wigan side. They've used one substitute, their second substitute, Richard Russell, doesn't seem to have taken the field for the start of the second half. Although Ian Gildart does look as though he's come back on. Kevin Allen. Back on. And it'll be John Woods who'll get this second half underway. Woods then puts one deep, Andy Gregory's there, traps it with his knees and takes it safely. Hands it on to Gildart, back on and good tackle from Tamati, first of the second half. Just looking to see who's gone off. It may be Ian Lucas who's gone off, who he was substituted, is Brian Case. Goes on with Gregory. Gregory, little chip over the top. Chase for the ball, favours uh, Wigan Edwards up to his feet, a mile forward. The ball picked up by Kevin Tamati. Who takes four Wiganers with him. But Warrington back in possession. An early score here could be vital. And a huge gap down the centre for McGinty. He's got Johnson leaking up his support. Johnson, he's looking to go all the way. Still Brian Johnson looking to come back inside. But Hampson comes across and slides him into touch. Another beautiful get break there. Brian Johnson flying through the gap again. Hampson this time, though, had narrowed the angle. And Johnson was slid into touch. But the gap's now appearing on both sides. Because there's a few tries going over in this second half as the gaps begin to appear. The legs become a bit tired and Gregory puts the ball in. Andy Gregory. Hampson out to Brian Case. Short one to Gildart. And that's in Crompton in there with a good tackle. Comes on this near side to Case. Tries to unload the ball, but ball well smothered by McGinty. Sean Edwards puts up a high kick down the centre. Johnson comes for it, takes it well. Brian Johnson then moves forward. Knocks off Gregory, gives the dummy. And he's pushed into touch. And that'll be another scrum. So it's come down midway inside the Wigan half. Andy Gregory puts the ball in. Wigan in possession. Edwards brings in Hampson across the line to Iro. Iro looking to beat men. Iro now storms forward. But finally brought down. Hanley. Soon as out with Edwards. Short one to Gildart. Crunching tackle there by Roberts, and he runs straight smack bang into Les Boyd, bounced off him, Dermot, on this near side to Graham West, West moves in field, tried to get the ball away but didn't, West finally up to his feet, Dermot gives a dummy, moves forward, goes across field, onto Edwards, space, Iro, Iro knocks off one man, still Kevin Iro, finally brought down, Edwards across to Gregory. Gregory goes left, still Gregory moving forward. Iro now, good tackle from Drummond, the ball loose and the ball somehow ends up in a Warrington player's hands. 
up with the ball. Who else but Kevin Tamati? Uh, John Woods, I should say. Good storming one there. Still going, finally plays it. Kevin Tamati looking to get away from one man, just caught by Gildart. As the night sky begins to come in on this new is it here's Crompton straight down the centre. Looks to support, finds it. Roberts looking to beat Hampson and does still Roberts. Looks to support, finds it from Johnson, gives it to Dummy, just still going, trying to get away. But can't, it's finally picked up by David Marshall. Goes out with Gregory. Turns it back in seal to Dermot. Edwards, Graham West, well tackled there, and the ball loose, goes on to Hanley to Edwards, Edwards now swings out over on that far side to Jed Byrne, but Drummond comes back with a fine tackle, no way was Jed Byrne going to get anywhere there, with Drummond coming across, just had him well beat for pace and dragged him into touch. So five minutes gone, still 13-4, scrum down. Just in the Wigan half, Crompton. Caught by Gregory, but Warrington in possession. John Woods to McGinty, McGinty moving forward, runs in hard. Coming back into the first team this afternoon, the absence of Mike Gregory, suspended. Ronnie Dwayne runs in hard. Brian Johnson to John Woods, Tamati beats one man. Goes out with Crompton, looking to get a lovely little dummy from Crompton, he's beat the cover again, Crompton, the pass is kicked on by Dave Lyon, he's having his jersey tugged, and the referee will give a knock on and a penalty for a push on Dave Lyon. Dave Lyon kicked it through and Dave Marshall tugged onto his jumper, not letting him get away. What will Warrington do? Go for goal and have six tackles just ten yards from the Wigan line. They're going to tap it. Tamati just puts the ball into touch. Just ten yards from the Wigan line. Tamati brings in Dave Lyon. Lyon head down, he stopped a couple of yards short. Tamati again, McGinty. Tamati, Boyd, Boyd crashing in, still Boyd. That is over. But the referee gives a penalty to Wigan. Boyd crashed his way over, but a little bit of pushing on the Wigan line. Hampson then puts for touch, makes no mistake. Case. Referee finally calls held. Out to West. West meets Boyd and Roberts. West still going. Kevin Tamati finally in to help out. Gregory out to Edwards. Edwards to Iro. Iro. Running in high, still Iro throws the ball out. Back inside comes Hampson. Hanley this time, out to Edwards. Edwards looking to go through himself, has a huge gap. Edwards now looking to go all the way. Still John Edwards is looking to go across, but Brian Johnson brings him down. Just five yards from the line. Gildart, Iro. Six tackle then for Wigan. Goes out with Hanley, chips it through, but that will bounce dead. And White can have a tap from the 25, and the danger is cleared. John Woods taps it, 
hands it on to McGinty. McGinty makes five or six yards before he stopped. Woods again out to Tamate. Tamate to Boyd. Boyd cuts his side. Boyd pounding forward. Hands the ball on there to Mark Roberts, who has stopped on the halfway line. Boyd once again ripping holes in the Wigan defence. Wigan all offside as Boyd plays it out to Woods. Crompton. Roberts gets the ball back to McGinty. Brian Johnson gives a dummy, comes on this near side. Stopped by Gregory and Iro. McGinty to Crompton. Across to Tamati. Straightens up. Gets the ball back to Crompton. He goes to his hands and Case dives on it. Dermot to Edwards. Across to Hanley. Hanley. What a crunching tackle there for Ronnie Dwayne. Goes out again with Edwards, short one to West, looked a suspension of a forward pass. Wigan looking to make a substitution, Richard Russell slipped off on the sideline as it's out with Andy Gregory. Gregory, lovely pass to Edwards, but equally better tackle for McGinty. Gregory again, looking for a gap himself, gets the pass away, but easily pushed into touch. And Richard Russell will now come on for Dave Marshall. And Dave Marshall being made to walk round. So scrum just outside the Warrington 25 as Richard Russell takes his place on the right wing. Ball goes in from Crompton. And Wigan in possession. Edwards to Hampson. Hampson looking to go through the gap himself. John Woods to come across to cut off the gap along with Ronnie Dwayne. Hanley this time. Edwards run out with Hanley. Brings in West. West back to Hanley. Hanley open the tackle to Edwards. Edwards dummies goes back. Finally straightens up and brought down. Dermot to Andy Gregory, delayed pass, but Roberts had hold of Gilbert. Dermot again to Gregory. Gregory gives a dummy, moves forward himself, still Andy Gregory. Gets a lovely pass away to Edwards, Edwards gives a dummy, but a good tackle from Brian Johnson. That's five tackles for Wigan, midway inside the Warrington 25, this is the sixth. Gregory chips one for the corner. Hampson has it, and it's a try for Hampson in the corner. Steve Hampson scores for Wigan. And Hampson brings big Wigan back into it at 13-8. So Steve Hampson rises high in the corner. 